Are you interested in selling your wood? Well, don't we have a solution for you? Just call the Wood Selling Service. We'll help you manage your money and find the perfect person to sell your wood to. Just call 1-800-SELL-YOUR-WOOD. Again, call 1-800-SELL-YOUR-WOOD. This company may or may not sell your wood to an evil person who may or may not back on the with their own child. Just call 1-800-SELL-YOUR-WOOD today. Just hear it from our happy customer, Miss Foster. Wait, where's all my money? Good morning, Tree Gap. Breaking news. Maytuck has struck a man in yellow suit who refuses to say his name, but only calls himself the stranger in the back of the head with a shotgun. We believe that May has done this because he was taking a 10-year-old girl named Winnie Foster against her will. This all happened 20 miles away from Tree Gap. We have been told May swung the shotgun around her head, hit the stranger in the back of the head, causing him to fall to the ground, and right now he's unconscious, but we don't know if he will live. May has been taken to the jailhouse and then will be taken to the gallows to be hung if the stranger dies. This will all take place in about a week, so get your popcorn and enjoy the show. Remember, kids under 18 years old are not allowed to come. We will now go live to a Tuck's house. Take, take it, it away, away, Sharon. Thanks, Amy. Hello, I'm Sharon Harlow, and today on Everlasting News, we're in a place 20 miles from Tree Gap where the crime took place. I'm here with Wilbur Higgins to interview him about what happened. Wilbur, why do you think May hit the stranger with a shotgun? She told me she was protecting the child, but I think she's crazy. Okay. Do you think that May deserves to be in jail? Since she is insane, I think she deserves to be in jail. Okay. Do you think the stranger will die? I hope he dies so I can use new gallows. Okay. Well, folks, you heard it from Wilbur Higgins. Next, we're going to be with Haley Rose interviewing 10-year-old Winnie Foster. Take it away, Haley. Thank you, Sharon. This is Haley Rose, live at the house where the crime scene happened. Today, we'll be interviewing Winnie Foster, a witness of the crime. Why do you think May hit the stranger with a shotgun? Well, according to our words, he was trying to protect me. Though this is true. The truth is, I didn't want to go. The man was taking me against my will, and I barely even know him. He's just referred to the stranger in my book, and as much as you might think not, and you think they quote-unquote kidnapped me, I see the text as my friends. Okay, then. Well, that leads us to our next question. Do you think May deserves to be in jail? Well, May Talk does have some really good reasons to be in jail, yes. But she struck the stranger for a good reason overall. It might not have been the best thing to do in that time and place, but I think she's innocent. So, do you think this stranger will die? Well, the way he may hit him plumb on his skull could surely cause the old man to die. But this certain feature, I don't feel most comfortable talking about it. Let's just say there's a 50-50 chance, okay? Thank you for viewing these exclusive interviews with the witnesses of the crime. Back to you, Alex. Well, that wraps it up for today. Thanks for tuning in on Everlasting News. Bye. Bye.